Hey there. In our last video, we found four different images uh, around one theme, talked a little bit about them and brought them and placed them onto our artboard. In this video, we're going to do what's called an image trace and uh, expand. And what that will do is tidy up some of the images. It'll change uh, some of them to a very contrasting kind of look. And uh, it also puts a fine stroke around uh, all of the elements of the image. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to start with uh, this one up top. Uh, so let's zoom in. Make sure that your control bar is showing. If it's not, you can go to Window and find it on the list and make sure it's activated. All right, with this selected, I'm going to click Image Trace in the control bar and then um, Expand. And you'll see that the watermark went away and now there's a fine stroke around all of these bits. Um, down here, uh, most of it went away. We can clean that up in a later video. We'll go ahead and change the stroke to blue and the line weight to 0 0.001. That's the line weight that the laser understands. Okay, let's move on to the next one, the Space Monkey. Monkey Knot. Notice it's got this writing down here. It's mostly black and white. Let's image trace it and see what happens. Hmm. Some of the nice writing went away and uh, the rest looks fairly the same. I'm going to go ahead and expand and change the stroke. And I'm thinking to myself if I would have changed the values maybe prior to doing that, uh, maybe we could uh, somehow get those words to stay uh, where they were. Okay. Let's move up to the black and white chimp, this one. And let's, let's see what happens when you image trace this one. It turns uh, black and white. Uh, it's a very kind of different look. Undo. Maybe. It's nice. They're both nice. So let's expand that and uh, change the stroke to blue. And finally, let's go down and do the color image. We'll image trace it. And it turns very dark. You still see little bits. And uh, if we were to somehow go into this and change uh, the hues and the values, uh, it would probably turn out very different. So there's all four of them again. In our next video, we're going to uh, clean them up and uh, make them look different and get them ready to laser cut. Um, but for now, you know, uh, just stop with the image trace and take a look at the different results you can generate with just a quick image trace of your graphics.